All right, today I wanted to go to a park, so I'm going to the Hanging Rock State Park in uh, North Carolina. Um, it's kind of cloudy today. I haven't left the house yet, but I'm just in the car right now. It's kind of cloudy today. Hopefully it doesn't rain. It's not too cold though, so. I'm here at the Hanging Rock in Walnut Cove, North Carolina, the state park. I'm going to find a place to park and then let's go walk down the trail and see what I can find. I don't know how far I'll be able to walk, but it's a nice day, so. I won't be here for too long though because it gets dark in like, I think, two hours, something like that. But I have a little bit of time, so that's good. Okay, so I was talking to one of the ladies that works, I guess she works in the office, and uh, she pointed me towards this way for the um, Indian Creek Trail. It has two waterfalls on it. I'm gonna try to see at least one of them. It says it's like 0.4 miles in, so that's not too far. I hope. They had these nice maps in the uh, in the office or outside of the office. It says that this trail is supposed to be strenuous. I like that little hut over there.
There's like no people here today. It's just um It's very quiet. I did see some hikers come in. Everyone else coming in. Okay. 0.3 miles from the waterfall. I think there's a person. Yeah, there's a person down here. This video is going to be very shaky. I don't have. I could have brought my little tripod with me that I use for streaming, but I didn't do it. I don't think it would have helped that much anyway. There's another bench. Have a lot of carvings in them. I bet this place is so beautiful in the fall <laughs> when all the trees are turning. Uh, oh, I hear it. I hear the waterfall.
like I think I've had four yeah three or four visits to the chiropractor and so far I'm just now starting to feel it in like my mid back the pain is coming back hopefully well climbing up is definitely going to be a bitch of course but okay so is the waterfall is this way I really hope it doesn't start to rain because it's very cloudy and I don't think it will. I didn't look at the weather today but This is called the Hidden Waterfall. Alright, I want to take some shots with the waterfalls. I'm going to see if I can make it down to the other one. I'm going to see what climbing up this is like first. <sighs> this is like the first... I guess the first time I've been out in the wooded area since I got hurt. The chiropractor did want me to exercise, so. Okay, window falls 0.2 miles.
huge tree fell over. Oops. something I'd like go in there to live like some squirrels or something I don't see anything in there though I'm gonna come here like early in the morning and just spend like a day here. Just taking shots and filming. I wanna see if I can't get up there to where that I guess mountain is. I don't think I'll be able to walk that far right now though. I like exploring. There's like a whole valley down there. I can't zoom in anymore. I'm gonna take some photos. I hear the waterfall now. I don't know, which are those arrows pointing? What says to view it? Hey, I guess this is the path. I see why they put that wrist sign up because if this is a wet, like this is already slick, but if it's a wet, 
Yeah. Okay, view of window. All the names people have engraved in the wood. Oh, there's like a little cave back there. Alright, I came down here a little bit closer to the fall. So beautiful. Happy I 
got the tattoos. The stunning image. This is as far as I'm going. My legs are like shaking right now. But there's so much to climb back up. I don't know what time it is. I think I got here at like four. Oh, make my way back up to the visitor center now. I was hoping there would be more birds out, but I guess it's winter so they all went somewhere else. I need to start bringing my tripod with me so I can practice with it the little one I have I bought a big one too I have no clue what I'm going to do with it but I need to practice using that also I don't have anything to carry all that stuff with me Oh my god, I'm gonna make it back up to that first bench. Oh. 
What was that noise? It's funny because coming here like by myself without the camera, I think I would feel completely different just because I'm, um, you know, completely alone. But with this, it just kind of feels like, you know, if something happens to me, at least it's recorded if someone finds it. God, I'm not trying to climb these stairs right now. Yes, there's a bench. Oh my god, my leg is really working so hard right now. They're shaking so much. Oh. I don't know how this thing, how I look in this thing. I can't focus it. Oh, I could, but I don't know how it would look. I think it's like 40 some degrees and I'm sweating. I don't know where to hit on the camera.
Okay, so pickle it. 0.6 there and back is, I guess, 1.2 miles. I know my back is going to be killing me when I sit down at home. I think this is the first bench I passed. Or maybe it's the second one. I don't remember. I think the one I sat at was the second one. Okay, for some reason my camera cut, I think it was at like 15 minutes, and then I guess it started recording again. I gotta figure out why, why it's doing that. You know, I don't think I've used one of these grills before. <sighs> Man. I did not walk the whole trail though. Parts I did walk were beautiful. <clears throat> oh my god, there's a squirrel. right there in the middle of the road.
He's moving around too much. I'm gonna take a photo of him. I was using my TENS machine on my ankle all last night because it was like hurting so much. And now it's not seeming to bother me that much at all. My car is so far away. Okay. I think the next time I come here, I want to try the Hanging Rock Trail. The mountains here are so beautiful. I was driving through them. My ears kept popping a lot. I didn't hit the... I thought I hit the stop recording button. Oh. That is the furthest I have walked in... Probably a year or a year, probably a year and a half. 
That's the furthest I've walked. <sighs> Man, like going through all the physical therapy and not being able to like, to barely being able to like walk through like the grocery store <sighs> after what happened in April. And then, Like, I've just felt so hopeless, I guess. And now, I've come this far after going to chiropractor. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be really sore tonight and tomorrow also but I go back tomorrow so <sighs> hopefully it won't be too bad <sighs> I'm really happy I got to uh, to do that today <sighs> I still feel super out of breath <sighs> anyway I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I don't know how much of it I'm going to keep in. I might just upload all of it. Um, but if you guys see this, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Uh, to my uh, YouTube channel. And like, every night, <clears throat> I do um, streams on YouTube and Twitch, and the uh, the Twitch name is um, Chrisfire64, and the YouTube name is at Water Cables. But I also have Chrisfire64 as my um, as my YouTube title. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope I'm not like blurred out or something on this thing. Thanks for watching. And wherever you are, have a good day or a good night. Let's stop this store. This is like the only place I found so far that sells cans of G Fuel. Like, it's really good too. This is the PewDiePie G Fuel. It's just at this little random gas station. I'm gonna go and see if I can't get something to eat. I need to move because there's a car behind me. I'm gonna walk up to this little kitchen here the gas station. This is not really good. Yeah, I just wanna place an order. Um, you can get the uh, cheeseburger with fries. You wanna do the basket? Yes, please. What do you want on your burger? Um, lettuce, tomato, pickles, onion, uh, ketchup, mustard, and hot sauce. Uh, that's all. Chris. Chris. Oops, it's a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little
gotta do something in the stream tonight. Just got my food. This place is called Checker Checker Girl. Four of my face is like super zoomed in. But uh thank you for watching. Um I have a I do a stream every night where I uh on um Twitch it's a uh, Chris Fire64 on YouTube is at water cables, but the YouTube channel is titled Chris Fire64. Uh, at Water Cables is my handle. Um, I just do streams every night where I just play games. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, um, please leave a like, you leave a comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna try to keep doing these, uh, or just go different places and film it. Um, I love having this camera and this opportunity to to be able to to film. I think next, well, when I come back here, I want to do Hanging Rock, but next, um, I think I want to go to a museum somewhere, a couple places I've been looking at online, but we'll see. Anyways. Thanks for watching, and wherever you are, I hope you have a good day or a good night.